What is up guys? Joe Holland here. I am here at the Rip Dam Sporting Camp. It's a couple nights day already and Max and I are fishing today for something totally new to me. We're going for the GMO of Maine. We're going for the Splake, which is a half brook trout, half togue. The Splake has been in Maine for several years now. They cannot reproduce, but the state likes them because they grow really fast for they're, they grow faster than a lake trout, faster than a brook trout, and they're pretty aggressive fish. I don't know how they taste. I really don't know how they look. I've caught one in my life. I caught one once when I was in high school. I was fishing with a buddy and I thought I had a four pound brook trout, four and a half pounder. It was, it was big and we were really excited about it. And he was like, oh, you gotta get that thing mounted, man. That's four and a half pound brook trout. Doesn't come very often. So we brought it home. And his dad looked at it and he's like, wow, nice splake. And it turned out it was a splake. We couldn't tell because the tail had been pretty well chewed probably from the hatchery. And it had like a square tail and it was really colorful. But hopefully we get a couple of these topside today and, and show you what they look like. How deep do you think we got? Uh, probably 40. Wow. I would not have guessed that. Well, we went to set the second trap and the first one's up. Did you leave it up? Yeah. Maybe it's a bait flag. Right. <laughs> yeah. What's she doing, bud? Running? Yep. Any weight? Yeah. Not huge. Feels all right. Holy colors. Wow. Nice little splake. Yeah, beautiful. Good start. Perfect. That didn't take long. No. Internet fishermen be like, you don't own the whole lake. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Rolling? It was. Yeah, it is. We got a fish. Any sauce? Nah, it feels like the same as the last one. Alright. Oh, he spit it right at the hole. Oh, man. Doesn't look like it's rolling yet, but that doesn't mean anything. That one feels good. You got one on? Yeah. Feels alright? Decent. 
Whoa. Nice. Beauty. Yeah, that's a pretty fish. They're prettier, a lot prettier than a lake trout. Pull them up. Hey buddy, thanks for playing. Good job. Nice. All right, that's three flags. We're not even set up. Three flags, two fish. Perfect. Oh, look at this friggin' ring. Holy cow. He's almost got all the line. <laughs> it feels decent, but it's yeah. so far away. Can't Still feeling good? Yeah. Well, now he's swimming it out. Yeah. Feels average. I don't know. Leader? Nice. Wow, that one's even got like a little purple tint to him. Yeah, that one looks more like a lake trout than anything. Yeah. Beautiful. Look at that. Pretty little fella. Very nice. Well, we are fishing with dead shiners, and you must kill your bait before you cross any water coming in here. And if you're worried about dead bait working, what are we at? Five flags, three yeah. fish, and we just got our traps in? Yeah. Yeah, we don't, and we don't even have, I mean, that's four traps in. Right. Because we're planning on digging. Not very big, but he's there. Might be my first flake of the day. He feels small. Real small. Oh yeah, there he is. That's a pretty one. Yeah. Look at that guy. Nice. Oh, we got you one, got two, two, two flags, flags up. up yeah. We better get to it. Yeah, I know. There he is, guys. Wow, he is pretty mm. red. Almost orange-like. Nice! All right, on the board. First flake that I ever tried for. Right. All right, let's, uh, I'll just leave this. We'll go get yours, because you got two flags up, I believe. Yeah. So. Just a little fell off. Nice. It's number? Five. Five. I think. Anything? I don't think so. Well, I got a flag too. Ooh, wow. One. You made a nice little run on you. Might be a different size. A average. Oh yeah, a little bigger. Wow, look at it. They, they get prettier each time. Super pretty fish. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. I got another flag too. Actually, that might be a cold one. Oh, was that another hook in there? Hold on, there's another hook in there. There is another. Yeah, I can get that one if you hold that one. Oh, there. We'll help him out. That's not from you. No. It? Cool, we got a leader. That's a pretty one. Wow. Oh, holy cow. Look at the colors on that. Yeah. He's like blue when you turn him. Yeah. Nice. Smashing them. Oh, down and dirty. Down and dirty. Nope, there's one there. Is there? Yeah, he's real small. I might have lost him. I don't know. Yeah, I think I lost him. Nope, he's still there. <laughs> <laughs> he was coming up. He feels a little better now, but nothing, nothing to write home about. Wow, he took some line. They bite pretty good for pound for pound. Whoa, look at that. Wow. Right outside of the mouth. Just barely hooked. All right. Look at that, buddy. Holy cow. 
Beautiful, huh? Yeah. Oh, my big smelt's up outside. Yeah, that's my big smelt. Got him. Nice. Holy pretty. Easy. Easy. That's a super pretty one, guys. You got orange and purple. Orange, purple, yellow, all the colors. And they got dots on their cheek plate, which is another sign that it's a splake and not a brook trout. And then the tail isn't flat. The tail's actually V'd as well. Our big smelt's been up for a minute out there. Yeah. Oh, nice. Cool. Good job. There's something there. That's bigger. That's bigger than the last couple. It's not huge, but he's definitely bigger than the last few. I use bigger bait on this one. Oh, saw the hole. He got a little active. Pretty light line, so I don't want to horse them. And the bottom edge of your ice is always a little bit sharp, so you got to be careful when they're working you just to let them go through. Yep. Oh, he's backwards. Oh, he wrapped himself all up. <laughs> nice one. Tacker in the pocket. That's weird. The egg's coming out of him. I thought these things are sterile. There he is, guys. Nice one. Beauty. Guys, we're having a day out here. We got a bag of dead bait. That's all you need. We, If you're fishing dead bait, my advice is don't let it freeze and have like frozen stale dead bait. You know, keep it as fresh as you can. It's freezing as the day's going by, but we're going to bring it in the shack. We got three holes drilled for the for the pop-ups because we we're going to do some jigging with a live scope, but we have not had a chance to stop. No, we we're have a, not. It's an awesome opportunity for you, you know, having this close to home, having just such an amazing fishery. So if you get your teeth kicked in like we did yesterday and have a hard day, you can always come over here and have a good day fishing. Have a great day fishing. Yeah, right. Really. And I mean, we're fishing these splake pretty much like Togue. We're set up anywhere from 30 to 60 feet of water. Uh, water's relatively, I mean, as far as Maine goes, it's pretty clear in here. We're fishing our baits anywhere from eight to 10 feet off bottom. And the fish are really cooperating today. Splake are pretty aggressive. Uh, we've been getting, I mean, every fish we've been catching today, they run like a togue. Yeah. They take tons of line. So don't sit around and let your traps up forever because you'll show up and have a mess of line on the ice, especially if you get a cold day. Oh, yeah. I'm running size six Eagle Claws, tying on 10 pound floral leader, running anywhere from 10 to 15 feet. Normally you'll run barrel swivels with live bait, but we ain't got that problem today. It's dead bait only, so they ain't swimming around and messing our lines up today. Nice. Just barely hooked. Splakeage. Yeah. Pretty fish. Mm. Yep, got him. He's not huge, but he's also not close. 16 to 18. Oh yeah. It's in that range. Yeah. Yeah, he's good. He's he's like that other good one I got. Nice. Yeah. I will say one thing, these guys fight like crazy. Oh yeah. Look at that guy. It's funny, like every single one of these are different colors. I know. Sorry to say, buddy, but you got another flag up too. There you go. Is he on? Yep. Doesn't he took a run on you. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't feel very big. Just a little bit. Oh, dude. <laughs> Beauty. There he is. Little guy. What is he eating that smell? He's half the size of the bait. Oh. 
There he is. Karim. <laughs> Karim. <laughs> There's another decent one. Look at that. Oh, they're nice. That's 17, 18. Holy cow, yeah. Fat belly. Pretty. I mean, feel that. Dude, feel how hard his belly is. He's, yeah. He is loaded with stuff. <laughs> and they're still eating. Something else, huh? I'm just blown away. I was just picking it up to check it. And I got it up like two foot in the air and something just grabbed it. Got another one on, guys. Feels pretty solid. Fighting like crazy. Nice. Oh, here we go. Oh. He's turning back for you. Oh, he's coming in on you hard. Eat it, eat it. Oh, he's, he's coming to you. Up. He's coming. He turned. That was freaking exciting. Hey, you got a fly. Oh, high flyer. <laughs> <laughs> Just say, I'm not getting that coffee. No, you're not getting the coffee, I guess. <laughs> Might be better. Big head shakes. He's just flying a hundred miles an hour. Got him. Nice little splake. How's he feeling? Average. Nice. Number 19. Number 19. At 10.30 in the morning. That's crazy. Wow, he's far. He is far. Good average one. Number 20. 20. That's crazy. Yes, sir. This one feels decent. Really? Yeah. Feels pretty good. Yeah, nice one. Oh, yeah. Solid. That's got green on it. That one looks more togue than anything. Yeah. Another nice one. Look at that one, guys. Decent. Oh, yeah, nice one. Oh, yeah. Jump right out of the hole. Beautiful. Like it? Yeah, I do. Big one? It feels good. It's way out there, but it feels nice swimming at me now. Oh, yeah, nice one. Beauty. Good one. It has just switched to rain, so we took a minute and got the otter set up. So we're going to be in there jigging out of the rain unless we get a flag, which is pretty highly likely. <laughs> Got him. That was a runner. Here he comes. Yeah, a little bit better. Not, not a lot, but... A I hate better. to be the bearer of bad news, but you got another flag, too. Nah. Yep. <laughs> Or out of this world. I hope the camera can pick it up being wet. All right, Max. What do you think, buddy? Another one? You in there? Oh, yeah. Got it? Killing it. Oh, nice one. Yeah, by far the biggest of the day. Look how dark he is. Yeah. Is that a toga or a spike? That's, that's, that's spike. Yeah. That's a nice one. Oh yeah, by far the biggest. Good one, buddy. Oh wow. He's long. Yeah. Skinny. 
freaking out. He's not bad. He's got like purple on the gills. Iridescent. Every one of them is different. Yeah, I know. He hit it. I don't know if he's come back. Oh, there he is. Got him. Got him. Got him. He came back. He's tiny. This might be our smallest one yet. Yeah. He's shaking his little tiny head. Oh, he's so cool. Oh, is that a brook trout? Jeez, I don't yeah, believe I don't so. Think so. No. Oh, oh you can see the stripes on this one. Yeah, that see? one looks more like a brook trout. I know, like a that. young brookie. Like, look at that. Wow, that, that thing's like bright purple. That is. That's the prettiest one by far. That is beautiful. That is the new record. That's the record? That's the new record, Sweet. 32. Nice. Native Maine Splake. Quick release. Nice one. Thirty six. Another one, guys. Yeah, we're getting wet. One comes in from the left, and then like another one oh, will come one. in from the right. Pretty one. That's purple. This is insane. This is insane, it's right. <laughs> Maybe not. That's it. There it is, number 40. <laughs> oh, what a day. Well, I guess we can count them. There's a big one. Nice. Big one. Big one. He is. Pretty one. Gave a wicked fight. That is a good one. The tip of his tail is even charred orange. Yeah, look at that. I don't know if people can see it or not. Oh, I'm up. Nice. Yeah, that's usually the next one after that. All right, well, here we are. Joe's fighting a fish. We got a flag there and another flag there. And we just got, what, three more fish? I don't even know at this point. Quick release. There we go. That's how you do it. Yeah. The clothes weigh an extra 40 pounds right now. Oh, man. Rain. How about you? Oh, I am. <laughs> I'm extra heavy today. This ice fishing gear is not made for rain. Yeah, and it has been raining for a while. Nice one. Another pretty one. Ready? Nice stumper. Nice stumper. Nice fish, huh? Mmm. Yeah. Oh, my bait. No, we need my bait. Another good one. Yeah, I had that earlier with those big head shakes right at you. Nice one. Beauty. He's a chunky one. Yeah. Feels decent, but he's a mile away. Oh, yeah, nice one. That B. Good job, buddy. Nice. Nice. Beautiful. Nerves of steel. Come on. Come on, baby. He's in the hole. He's out of the hole. Hey! There it is. That is 
the 50th fish on the day. Half a century, Mark. There it is, guys. Half a day. We got 50 on the ice. We only fished four lines each all day. There it is, number 50, going back. Can't believe we did it. <laughs> Cannot believe we did it. I'm gonna have to watch the film myself. <laughs> oh, he, he puked up a pin smell. See it? Yep. Let a boy. Let a boy. Oh, give me a bait. Oh. You getting bigger? I think he was around the boulder. Yeah, he got a little bigger. He's 17, 13. <laughs> 12, 11. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that was a nice one. Yeah. Yeah, just. These things are gorgeous. Beauty. Fork tail. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. This is way bigger than I thought. Yep. He's not tiny. Yeah. All right. Pick it up. Guys, this is the last trap of the day right here. Feels like a cask. Yeah. Imagine. Last trap of the day. We got a flag. And it's a dandy. Is it? Yeah, uh, oh, look at that. Look at the color on that one. Oh, man, that's a beaut. What a dandy. Holy. Nice. That puts an exclamation point on the day. I would say so. And look at this fish. You see the color on that? Look at that. It's like a char. Holy cow, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, he's got a, he's got a uh, hook already coming out of his face. <laughs> Someone come in here and wasted a bunch of hooks. You ain't kidding. All right, guys, that is going to do it for the fishing part of today's video. We're going to head back to camp, so stay tuned for that, for dinner and some camp life. What do you think, bud? How do we do? I don't. I lost track. Oh, that was incredible. How many, what do we end up with? We ended up with 56 fish. Crazy. 56. 56, give or take a few. We might even lost count. Uh, yeah, I honestly, I couldn't <laughs> tell you. It got, it got pretty hectic there for a while. Awesome fishing. We didn't lose many fish, but we had a bunch of other flags too. It could have could have been a bigger day. What we we only fished four lines each. Yeah. As you guys can see from the overhead, we covered just about every square inch of this <laughs> this uh 200 yard patch where we caught all those fish. Maybe. Maybe not even 200? Yeah, yeah, maybe. How many miles did you put on? I put on 6 miles today <laughs> driving a 200 yard square. <laughs> <laughs> I burned one click of gas in this yeah. thing. <laughs> In a 200-yard square. Oh, man. We had her pretty well buttoned up. That was awesome. <laughs> yeah, what would you say for these splakes? So we targeted them, what, from 35 to 65 today? Yeah, 35 to 65. Yep. Anywhere from 8 to 10 off bottom. Yep. Dead bait. Dead bait. Yep. Uh, light line and small hooks. Yeah. Yep. That was pretty much the ticket. Yeah, pretty awesome day. So hope you guys like this video. Hope you like the format of it. We might do some more like that in the future. And... We're going to talk over tonight what we're going to do tomorrow. We have endless possibilities going out of Max's camp. There's literally a hundred different opportunities within 20 minutes. Yeah. yeah. We got some decisions to make tonight. We got some, we got some decision making for sure.
made it back to the sporting camps cooking up some deer with onions and peppers and potatoes for dinner. Doesn't get a lot better than that. This is some deer that my good buddy Russell Ogilvy shot and gifted to me. And the cool thing is, Russell and Max are friends too. They worked together in the Rockland area uh, a couple years ago. So, small world, very small world as you guys know. Okay guys, that's gonna do it for tonight. Dinner was pretty well awesome. Had an amazing day on the hard water. By far the most trout I've ever seen in one day. And a lot of people, I mean, some years I don't see 56 trout in a whole year. And to see that many in one day was pretty special. So pretty amazing day. Hope you guys enjoyed it and tune in for tomorrow's. We got a little multi-species day going on tomorrow.